Hi everybody, welcome to World Swap. This is Fat Frog, and today's episode is all about poop. We want to get some nice fertilizer to get our farm going a little gr- Hey man, what's going on back there? What's going on back here? I'm trying to make a video, and i got raptors falling into my taming pen here, causing problems. What the heck? Come on, this is a poop episode. That's right, I said it's a poop episode. Go away. Hey, what'd you leave for me? Crap. Ha! <laughs> That's funny. Not really. Alright, so today's episode is all about poop. We want to get poop and turn it into fertilizer so we can get our uh, farm going. Actually, kick it up a notch. We've already got kind of a little garden going right now. Um, but we really want to kick it up a notch. So we're in the T-Rex taming pen with a dung beetle. And uh, let's see, we want to tame this guy up. Dung beetles are passive tame, they're kind of pretty. Um, so you've got to poop. Poop? You got to poop, yeah, sure. Uh, let's see, so we're going to go into our inventory and we've got some poop. We're going to put that in here. Now, you've got to sneak up on a dung beetle, and so you can use insect repellent, I think, uh, which you can make in uh, mortar and pestle. Um, or you can uh, wear the ghillie suit like I've got on here and I just made this to do a calisotherium tame which is also passive and you want to uh, to not spook one of those critters because they will kill you and in this case um, we want to tame this guy there we go and we already gave him a poop earlier so this is a do wild dung beetle level 45 um, so we want to let's go and put another turd in our hot bar already and so we're going to want to tame this guy up because these are supposed to be an efficient way of turning poop into fertilizer so we're going to tame him up now there's another trick to getting poop and that's one of the other things that we want to do while we wait for this guy uh, next feeding and that is to get a Fiomia, which is a pretty useless creature except for poop. So we're going to fly around here and just take a quick little look around. This thing just fell from the sky. What was that? I think it was a Dimorphodon, but I don't know what killed it or where it came from. Uh, Allosaurus, we'll avoid that. Um, let's see... I hear the pitter-patter of little scorpion feet. So we're looking for a Fiomia, which I believe you can, according to rumor, force feed stem berries and make it poop like crazy. Oh, there's one right there. So we're going to grab one of those. I see another one as well. Let's see, did we get one? We did, we got a wild Fiomia. And it's something, uh, also a nice thing about Fiomia is you finally have something to do with all those stupid Fiomia saddles that you find in drops. So we're heading back to the T-Rex taming pen, which I made for the purpose of taming T-Rexes in a safe and efficient manner. So we're going to drop that guy right in there. Let's go and get the second Fiomia right away. Actually, before we do that, let's go get some food. I can't believe you're still alive. Uh, this guy, Cheater, here is on Wander. What level are you? 134? Actually, you need a uh, need a boost, too. I know this is a poop video, but what the heck. Uh, let's give you some health. Who's 723. So, it seems a Parasaur has fallen into my T-Rex taming pen. Okay, so there's our dung beetle who needs some more poop. We'll come up around over here. Get close. There we go. Oh man, we waited too long. So small animal feces, is that what it said? Oh well, let's do this. So I think we'll just have to pay a little more attention to our Fiomia, or not our Fiomia, but our dung beetle. But while we're doing that, we might as well get this uh, Fiomia down. And this guy has left us a turd already. Alright, so we got our darts. This is a level. What was this level? 20. No big deal. So we're going to bring this guy down. Might as well be efficient today. 
Is it going down? Oh, two shots. That's right. Uh, you don't want turds. You want some mijo berries. All right, you're eating some of that. Very cool. So let's go see about getting you some more food. We gotta wait till you're hungry again. Gender not available. <laughs> gender not available. That's that's a new one to me. Gender gender neutral. And we're pausing. Okay. So anyway, I'll uh, just show you the T-Rex standing pen. If you haven't seen that video, I could put a link in the description if I remember. Anyway, basically I just annoyed a T-Rex and got it to follow me off the cliff. Bloop. I was riding a Pteranodon at the time. And then it's stuck in here and you can shoot it safely from the cliff or from one of these door openings over here. Not have to worry about it. We've gotten some level uh, 150 Rexes doing that. And some other stuff as well. Not hungry yet. Uh, the dung beetles don't live on this part of the island. Uh, we uh, caught this guy over on the uh, Skull Island, the Batman Island, whatever you want to call it. And we just uh, grabbed him on an RG and dropped him in here for our taming pleasure. Um, but they're really cool. Look at them. They're really cool looking, man. They really got that iridescent shine to their carapace. That's what you call the uh, covering over their wings there. Uh, this parasaur is annoying me, but it's nice and that is leaving turds behind. Are you going to need some narcotic there, buddy? Did you eat all your food already? You did? Oh man, everything is so hungry around here today. Now, did I have a turd in the inventory? I sure did. Maybe I need, it said small animal feces. Maybe a large one would be better. Let's see. So I've never tamed dung beetle up today, uh, before today. Wait till it's hungry. Oh, something's going on out here. This could be a problem. Is it the dialogue? What's going on over here, man? Where are you going? Where are you going? I mean, really, where are you going? I want to know. <laughs> Grace, come back here. What were you after? All right, so it looks like we're going to have to get some more Mijo berries, so we might as well do that. Um, we've got a bunch back at the farm. So we'll go get that. We'll grab that other Fiomi on the way back, and then uh, we'll see if we can get that dung beetle tamed up. That's what we're really worried about today. But we'd also like to see if we can get that Fiomia uh, poop machine trick to work. So when we do that, we'll be back. Okay, we're back and a new day is dawning here on the Ark. We uh, had some weird issue with our other dung beetle. It just stopped eating. Uh, not sure what was up with that. So we've got a new one here. Unfortunately, it's a high level. We don't need a high level dung beetle. I don't think it will produce any more fertilizer than anything else. Um, why is that parasaur running? Oh, it's an angry dillo. An angry dillo. Anyway, um, so we don't need a high level dung beetle at all. I'm froze. Why can't I hit you? There we go. Come on. 95 down. Okay. So, uh, so yeah, so we went and grabbed another dung beetle to test that out. So during the night, the Fiomi is both tamed up because we went and got that other one after we went back to base and got our stash of mayo berries. So we got a mate boosted pair of Fiomi is over here. Let's put away our thing. Okay, let's see if our guy is hungry. He's still not hungry after a trip across the world. Um... Let's look at this guy and see what he says. Okay, feed small animal feces to tame. All right, so small animal feces, so that's different. So what do I have? I have medium and medium, large, medium, medium, and medium. And I have one small. So let's try the small, well, hold on. What do I have down here? I have one small did I and I have I just have the one small okay so let's give this a try all right 135 is on his way so I don't know if this guy got scared or something 
or if he and he sort of reset or if I gave him too large a feces or what uh, I'm not sure but the Fiomias are already pooping their little brains out I'm just gonna store these turds in here it looks like we're gonna need to find some small animal feces well this is interesting what's going on over here are they after that parasaur they are after the parasaur okay I've never seen them do this before so a parasaur is just a obviously a very passive creature that is really strange and it's kicking its butt I guess as far as parasaurs go well if that's the case then we're gonna get these guys out of here uh, maybe that's the problem so alright dudes let's go this way we'll get you back to the farm there's cheater what are you up to cheater come on Fiomias see if we get these guys safe so we'll get these guys safe we've got a bunch of small animals back at the farm we'll try to get them to poop and whatnot and we'll lead our Fiomias home. Hopefully they survive the dangerous island. Hey, there's another Fiomia. Uh, and we'll be back and we'll see if we can get uh, get some better success. Okay, so I thought I would just show you um, me collecting some poop. So I've got a bunch of poop from these dodos. They're in my dodo coop. They're uh, just kind of wandering around. Hello, dodos. How's it going? Uh, so this is a great way to collect some small animal feces and some dodo eggs. Where are, is there any other poop up here? So I just got a bunch. Let's check the inventory. Uh, I collected a bunch of other eggs, not just brown ones. So I've got a bunch of poop and there's poop timers on here. So we got 48 minutes left on this, on this little poop here. If it's out and about in the world. Oh, I guess it's got a 50 minute timer on here too. These dodos are so cute. Uh, excuse me guys, I'm trying to get your poop. No, I don't want you. There we go. Might as well level up some dodos. I just give them health so hopefully they can survive an attack on something. They make cute little noises. They drop my frame rates. Level 133 Dodo. Oh, you left a nice brown egg for me, Dodo. Thank you, level 86 Dodo. How about you? Anybody else got some turds for me? So I'm going to collect as much of this as I can. Uh, <laughs> so at the rest of the farms, we've got a lot of animals out there, but they don't seem to poop all that frequently. Um, so I'm going to hang around here for a few more minutes. Um, get at least a dozen of these dodo turds or other small turds and then we'll head back over there we brought the Fiomas, Fiomias back and got them a saddle already I heard something poop yeah oh <laughs> it's great that's why Ark is great for kids pooping all kinds of pooping and it's easier to pick stuff up by the way when you're using uh, crossbow or a gun like this we got your little crosshairs and you can uh, easily target that poop so anyway we'll be back all right we just got ourselves a dung beetle and it took quite a while to tame up this level 135 we will call him the poop master and we'll accept him into our group might as well just go ahead and check out those stats right away Oh, you can pick this guy up. Can we toss him? Yeah, we can. All right. Uh, let's access that inventory. Health is 1,600. Let's see. What else do we got on this guy? Stamina 420. Like, we really even care, though. Um, weight 7.1. Holy cow. That's not much at all. Uh, melee damage 253.9%. Movement speed 100%. Oh, I did it again. Okay, so let's access that inventory one more time so how much poop can we get into this guy uh, not eggs so we can get a lot of poop in there so there's the poop master 
Um, did I bring anything actually that can carry the poop master back to base? Uh, let's find out. There goes the doors. Where's my guy? I brought a flyer over here. Ah, no? Yes? I can't remember what I did. It's been a while. So anyway, it took quite a while for this guy to tame up. When I came back with the new, um, with more poop and whatnot, uh, the dung beetle, the other dung beetle was dead. And I'm not sure what that was all about. I can't pick him up with this stupid tapijara. So I'm going to have to come back and get a different flyer. And uh, we'll take him back. We'll go get that. Uh, we'll go get Argentavis to pick him up. And then we'll take him back. And we'll see how he works out as far as turning poop into fertilizer. Okay, so we're back at base and we've got our Fiomias over here, over there. We've got our compost piles going. And uh, yeah, so we're all set for the poop hour. Dung Beetle is over here. He's now level 202. Um, and he has no sex and he is wandering. He is completely loaded up with feces. As you can see, his weight is only 7.1. We've got 6.6 .6 on there and, uh, and poop. So he's ready to go. Um, we're going to try the uh, Fiomia trick to create more um, poop. So we're going to access the inventory here. We're going to put in stem berries. I'm going to just give him some health so he can survive in case he gets uh, attacked by some Allosaurus. Okay, so we're just going to select the stem berries and then remote use. And you can see the poop machine has begun. crazy and disgusting oh my gosh that's so gross but yeah so the stemberry trick definitely definitely works with the fiomias i've got the saddles on them now that uh, we collected in drops just going to collect some of these turds uh, they poop a lot anyway compared to other creatures um, so even without the stemberry uh, trick you're going to be uh, in the poop so um over here speaking of poop are the compost bins I just loaded these up from uh, stuff that I had around uh, 50 uh, let's see 50 thatch and I think two poops make a bag of fertilizer which I have bags of fertilizer stored over here so I've got a few over here to get started I want to start uh, raising up some more crops which I have over here in order to make crops you're going to need a crop plot. You're going to need some seeds. Like I have long grass seeds over here. And then you're going to have to uh, add some sort of fertilizer. Now you can add straight up poop. But the uh, the bags of fertilizer, uh, they just work better. They hold more and whatnot. So we're just going to load them up with all this extra Fiomia poop. We're actually going to take these crop plots out. Um, we've got plenty of vegetables right now but I want to grow a bunch of narco berry plants so I don't ever have to go out and uh, bother collecting narco berries anymore we've got this uh, this small garden here is hooked up to this uh, this water tank here which is you can see is 101 of 200 it's not irrigated because it's not raining but it is um, providing water for our plants right now so anyway that's gonna do it for today's episode on poop it was eventually successful. Um, I don't remember if I said it, but our other guy, um, our other dung beetle got killed somehow. And I'm not really sure why. So our guy is over here. He uh, only creates poop when he's wandering, if I didn't mention that either. Um, so you've got to do that and have some place um, where he's confined. In the farm here, we're completely enclosed. And as long as I remember to close the doors. Uh, he won't wander off so again I hope uh, you enjoyed the video if you have please give it a thumbs up subscribe to the channel and thanks for watching we'll see you next time